Uh, the Tom Brady Hall of Fame induction ceremony was perhaps punctuated by the reunion of the two men most associated with the Patriot Way and the greatest run by any franchise in NFL history. Two men who led the dynasty reuniting at Foxborough once again for Tom Brady's Patriots Hall of Fame induction ceremony. And they had nothing but kind words to say about each other. Uh, sometimes people just don't give him enough credit for how very few bad plays uh, he had a quarterback as a team. Let me make this crystal clear. There is no coach in the world I would rather play for than Bill Belichick. It wasn't me, it wasn't you, it was us. Brady also sharing the moments he was most proud to be a Patriot. He says one of those came in 2002 when the Patriots changed the way Super Bowl introductions were made forever. We were the first team ever to take the field in the Super Bowl, not as individuals, but as a single unit. That's us. And although plenty of compliments were shared, some rows were also aimed at TB12. Drew Bledsoe, who Brady forever replaced as the starting quarterback position back in 2001 in this dynasty, made it clear there was one thing the GOAT was not the greatest of all time at. You were the worst backup quarterback in the history of the NFL. You never understood that when I got healthy, you're supposed to go sit the hell down. <laughs> Can't be great at everything, right? You know, this induction ceremony was unique in a number of ways. Brady is the 35th Patriot to join this Hall of Fame, but he's the first to ever have his induction ceremony held here at Gillette Stadium. In fact, Patriots owner Robert Kraft waived the four-year traditional waiting period to ensure that Brady is now a member of the Patriots Hall of Fame. Live from Gillette Stadium here in Foxborough, Stephen Quinn, 7 News, today in New England.